crazy in my heart. Good afternoon, ladies. Superstar Kid BJ. We're getting ready for dinner. Tonight, we're having scrambled egg and cheese. I have more cookies over here, as you guys can see. We're going to eat up the last one. I have my Jamaican patties. I have my hash brown patties, as you guys can see. We're having hash browns tonight. I have my Smokies and my Kool-Aid drink. Good afternoon, ladies. Superstar Kid BJ. We'll go ahead and open up um, these hash browns. And we'll put some hash browns inside of our uh, air fryer. So this is my first time doing hash browns. And we'll do the smokers on top of my stove. We're gonna open up the patties. We're gonna do um, now patties today. So I try to make the video fast today because I'm I've been super busy all day today. So I try to do it best as I can. So we'll put the uh, beef patties in the pan here, as you guys can see. And it said put it in there for like you know 35 to 45 minutes. So we'll see how it goes. We'll make it very very quick for you girls. I'm gonna show you guys how I make my food. Um, I cook every day. I want to show you guys how to cook as well and let you girls know how to cook. So if, you're, if I'm not with you, you'll know how to cook. Okay? As you guys can see. All right, let's get started. So what we're going to go ahead and do is place the, um, I have my stove on here. Place the beef patties inside. Oh, we're going to make cookies tonight. Sorry about that. Place the cookies at the bottom. So I have my cookies, I have my beef patties. We'll let that cook. I have my air fryer here. As you guys can see, we're gonna put the um, hash browns in there. First time doing hash browns. So we'll lace one there. We'll do two. We'll do, we'll do four hash browns. I like hash browns. We'll put it inside the air fryer there. We'll go ahead and cut it on and we'll put it in there for about about a few minutes. We'll do about 10 minutes. So we'll let that cook up and we'll go ahead and start on the um, the wieners. These um, oxtail smokies. So I'm showing you girls the behind the scenes of how I cook my lunch and dinner. So we'll go ahead and get started. We'll do a couple wieners, not too much, but just enough. We have our dinner and our um, dessert. I have my spatula here. Cooking in. So we'll let that marinate. Let's see how it goes. I keep you guys posted. Let it cook up. We'll see how it goes. See you in a little bit. Just about ready. We'll go ahead and check on our patties. Peek. All right, we're just about ready. Have a couple more minutes of that. My cookies are getting there. My patties are still doing their thing, so we'll let that cook up. And look, look like they're almost about ready. So I'll just keep finishing this mess up and going over it, and then I sh it should the dinner should be ready so very soon. They almost look ready. I think they're ready. They almost look ready. When it start turning black, it's getting ready. Here's my scrambled egg and cheese. What we're gonna go ahead and do? You can see. Crack the eggs. Crack another one. There we go. And now we'll go ahead and um, I usually do shredded cheese, so we'll go ahead and do. Um, Regular cheese, so we'll go ahead and just drop a few pieces in there. Like One more egg. There we go. And this is how you make scrambled egg and cheese. You put the eggs in and then you put your cheese in. You can do shredded cheese, it's very, very recommended. But I, um, I want you girls to do um, shredded. What we're gonna go ahead and do is stir it up really, really nice and good. Just All right, stir it up. Stir it, keep stirring. The stove is ready for me. Keep stirring, keep stirring. All right. So now, the stove is ready for me. Woo! I almost got on my uh, arm. That's why I don't like. Um, a lot of guys ask me why do I. Um, 
get away from the stove because sometimes the stove gonna pop that grease on. What we're gonna go ahead and do now, okay, we'll do this right here. We'll let it marinate and we'll keep stirring around. As you guys can see, the cheese is kind of like getting ready, to, it's kind of like making or whatever. So yeah, this is how you make scrambled egg and cheese. So if you didn't know how to do it, this is how you do it. As you guys can see, it doesn't really take long, and it's cooking. So as you pick this cheese up, it's, it's uh, making. So it doesn't really take long to uh, make it. It takes about, um, oh, you know, just a couple minutes. I don't know exact time, but it's a couple minutes. And as you keep stirring, it will pile up. And there you go, y'all. Let's see. It's almost ready. It doesn't really take long. So I might start me a cooking show, uh, teaching girls how to cook, teaching them how to uh, make things at home. If you know you don't want to go out to restaurants, that's what I'm here for. I'm here to teach you how to cook. Save, um, you save a lot of money. You know, save a lot of money, just not by going to restaurants. So now your, your egg and cheese should look just like this. And now it is ready. That is how you cook travel egg and cheese. All right, it's ready. That's how you cook shrimp egg and cheese. You're going to see. All right, ladies, dinner is ready. Today we have my shrimp egg and cheese. I have my Jamaican patties. I have my hash browns. I have my um, smoky uh, cocktails. I have my chocolate chip cookies and my beautiful cherry drink. We're going to go ahead and pour up a cup of success. Let it marinate, as you guys can see. All to the tabletop here. And this is my late night lunch in my beautiful home. I have a new poster board here, as you guys can see. Enjoy nature. All right, we're going to eat up this beautiful, beautiful lunch that I um, cook, and let's go ahead and get superstar started. Superstar KBJ, the only superstar in Atlanta, Georgia, and across the globe. Now, today we have my chocolate chip cookies. I have my dinner for tonight. I have my scrambled egg and cheese, my ox, my cocktail smokies, my hash brown, and my Jamaican patties. So, and my, um, cherry kool drink. So what we're gonna go ahead and do, start out first, we're gonna start out with um, the egg and cheese, as you guys can see. We're gonna give it a bite and see how it tastes, as you guys can see. Very, very impressed. Very delicious. Now we're gonna start out one of these cocktail smokers, as you guys can see. Nice and crispy. Tastes just like morning breakfast. Now we'll go ahead and try one of these Jamaican patties, as you guys can see. Fresh off the oven. First time um, try one of these of what I personally made, as you guys can see. Mm. A little bit hot. It tastes just like the Jamaican patties from the restaurant. Very, very immaculate. Now, hash brown. We're going to get a piece of this hash brown, as you guys can see. Mm. It tastes just like IHOP hash browns, but also Crystal's hash browns, if they sell them. Now, chocolate chip cookie. Every night vibes are very, very great for the soul. Very delicious. Nice and tender. And also nice and crunchy. Kool-Aid. Cheers to see. Cheers to my success. Y'all, 
I'm loving my beautiful home. I'm so blessed. I love my new home. I love my everyday cooking. Everything is just great. I mean, I don't know why. It's just so... You know that feeling just like, it just doesn't seem real. I feel like a movie. I'm both not coming to this here, as you guys can see. I'm going to do a cheers to my beautiful home. My neighbors, they don't bother me. They're very, very quiet. Very, very quiet neighbor there. Cheers to great lunch and a beautiful lifestyle. To the Al Capones.